The financial health of Alabama's hospitals extremely strained right now as the stay at home order restricts elective procedures and outpatient operations. Furloughs and hour reductions began for workers today at Infirmary Health. NBC 15's Rachel Wilkerson joins us now. Rachel, you spoke with nurses who are seeing their paychecks impacted. I did, Andrea. Infirmary Health says it has to make staffing adjustments to account for the revenue loss due to COVID-19. Nurses I spoke to today say it's putting a strain on many employees. Without any patients, we don't have a job. A nurse at Mobile Infirmary who did not want to be identified says due to the COVID-19 pandemic, many services have been temporarily closed or have a significant patient drop. Some employees are being forced to cut back hours or not work at all. There's no money coming in. You're not doing elective procedures anymore. Nobody's coming through the emergency room. And so your only admits are basically COVID people. An infirmary health spokesperson says for nearly a month, Infirmary Health provided supplemental pay, but today it had to furlough more employees. Those furloughed will maintain their insurance benefits. It doesn't count against you for you not coming to work, but you have to use your own sick time to cover your hours for that week. So it's not something that the hospital pay. You basically pay yourself. One nurse at University Hospital who wanted to remain anonymous says she's stuck in the same situation, stating, quote, our hours have been extremely cut. We are forced to take a day off per week, and if there aren't any cases, we have to leave or sent home as soon as we are done. She goes on to say we have to either use our paid time off or go unpaid. It's unfortunate. USA Health released a statement saying in part, as a result of our lower patient volume, we have begun to flex our staffing levels to match our patient care needs. And Spring Hill Medical Center staff members are also working reduced hours, according to its president. The hospital is not reporting any layoffs or furloughs at this time. All hospitals say they are working with staff members and physicians during this time. A full statement can be found on our website at mynbc15.com. Andrea.